Hey guys, Brian here with another Clash of Clans video, and today we have episode number two of Road to Champs, Go Wee Wee edition. Um, we did lose 17 trophies and defenses, and we are down to 2264. We're still up a good amount, about 70 trophies. Today I'm going to try to gain 90 trophies in this episode, and let's try to three-star this Town Hall level 10 right here. Now he does have two Inferno Towers. One of them is level two. Um, I am going to attack from the bottom, um, probably this side. Actually, no, I want to take out the level 3 one as quick as I can, so I'm going to attack from this side right here. First, I'm going to check if he has any clan castle troops. That hog should do the job. It doesn't look like he does, which is good for us. That should mean an easy 3-star, I hope. Um, so let's go ahead and spread out these golems here. Have them tank up all the damage. Going to put down my wall breakers. Just get this T intersection right here. Why not give him a rage spell too? Oh no, my wall breaker is a little bit weak. I, I mean, my golem there is a little bit weak. That's not good. So I'm going to put down my wizards. Um, spread them out behind the witches as usual going in put down more wall breakers now I need to put down a free spell pretty much right now so my wall breakers don't die I did that a little bit too late that's not good um, I'm gonna get my heroes involved get them heading towards the center take out as much as I can I am gonna put down a rage ball right here I have to use another free spell because I don't want this inferno damage uh, inferno tower to do too much damage to my troops I still have a couple wall breakers left um, the king is about to go on the Inferno Tower, which is great. Please take it out. All right, that level 3 Inferno Tower is gone. We have a bunch of witches and wizards amassed over here. And it looks like they're going to make their way. I'm hoping the king... I'm actually going to use this building now because I'm hoping the king can take out that Inferno Tower before those witches and wizards get over there. Great. So we should have this 3-star. No problem now. I still have my queen's ability. The queen's ability is, like, great. It's, like, pretty much guaranteed to get you, like, 10 or 15% if you know how to use it. Um, so I'm going to wait until... I don't even think I have to use it. She's going to beat that expo, so she still has her ability. A bunch of side buildings here. I'm just going to put down these archers to try to take them out a little bit faster. Still have a lightning spell as well. Looks like we are going to have some problems with these Teslas, though, on the outside. So hopefully the queen doesn't get caught up on these walls and the Teslas take her out there. Um, we do have so many witches and wizards left, so I don't think that'll be a problem. I'm just going to... Should I use her ability now? I don't think so. I'm going to wait a little bit. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I'm, I need to use her ability. going to use her ability there. Um, she is taking a lot of damage now from that Tesla. Will she die, though? I don't think so. Oh, no, that bomb. There's a bunch of bombs over here. Will they get our little horde of troops over here? That is a lot of troops. Where's the bomb? It should be right there. Oh, there's a spring trap. Only took out two archers. Nice. Wall breakers go. Will the wall breakers damage those? Oh, please do. Dude, I think the wall breakers actually hit those. That's pretty crazy. All right, so we did get the three star there, guys. There is 33 trophies added on to what we are at so far. That puts us up to 2297, so we're making good progress so far. Our goal today is to get to 2350, so I will see you guys in the next attack. All right, guys, now before we begin our second attack, um, I went ahead and I changed around my base. As you can see, I made it more of a trophy base just because I want to expedite the process of getting to champions with Gowiwi because I'm kind of excited to move on to another um, attack strategy. Um, as you guys can see, my defense has been losing a bunch. I actually won this one, which was pretty funny. So I'm going to show you guys this defense really quick. And I think it'll also be a lot more fun for me to be able to show you defenses because um, I'm sure most of you guys who are pushing to champions and want to know how aren't going to be sitting with a farming base. So... This guy, I guess he wanted a bunch of my Dark Elixir. I had 4,200 available, and he decided to go ahead and use a Lava Hound, which is like 750, I believe. Um, and he barely gets his Dark Elixir back. If not, he doesn't get any of it. He doesn't even take my Town Hall, so I don't know what this guy was thinking. Um, maybe he was just like, oh, 4,000 Dark Elixir, and then went ham and didn't realize how strong my base was. Uh, but he did not get very far. He puts down his heroes here in a second, and they just don't go towards the center there. Which, you'd think they would, but their AI is pretty funny. So he gets around 796 Dark Elixir. I guess if that's worth it to him to gain the 76 Dark Elixir, um, then good on him. But anyway, guys, so this is going to be my base from now on. And this base comes from my war base. I'm going to show you guys that really quick. Um, I only had one problem with this when I was trying to recreate it onto my actual base. Um, as you guys can see, I have it up here at the top. Um... All the way scattered out against the wall but when I go back to my home base um, I, I now have a Halloween headstone up there so I was unable to do that um, I've had to redesign a couple of my bases before based on this Christmas tree so these are just pre uh, presenting a little bit more obstacles for me so I went ahead and I turned the base on its side just flipped it over and if you guys look at it like this I, I guess it'd be like this for you guys um, 
then that would be the same base as my war base. It's a really strong base, it lures people, but it's going to be an awesome base. But anyway guys, let's go ahead and move on to the second attack. Alright guys, I have been looking for some Town Hall level 10s, but 34 trophies is too GC for me to pass up. I did check all my revenges, none of them are available unfortunately, so I'm not going to be able to get any higher than that. Um, so let's see what we can do here. Just a Town Hall level 9. Not too worried about what he has to come out. Let's see what he's got in the clan castle. Alright, looks like he is going to have a bunch of troops in there, so I'm just going to go ahead and use my archers to get them all out. And some giants, that's pretty awkward. I'm not sure what he's trying to accomplish there. Maybe buy time for his defenses. I'm just going to lightning spell for the archers. And uh, I'm going to attack from the bottom here. Put down my golems. And um, here comes the witches. Shouldn't be a problem. I'm, I'm not suspecting any like traps um, to be on the outside here. Most of them are probably going to be on the inside. going to put down a rage spell as well as my heroes. Get them inside there. Didn't you need to use my hog to get the clan castle. So I'm just going to put him down anyway so he can do some extra damage for us. Wall breakers are going in. Hero should head straight towards the center, no problem here. Um, don't need to freeze anything on this base. We shouldn't have that much of a problem getting the 3 star. Everything's looking good so far. My golems are actually tanking up a lot of the defenses. My king is actually taking damage from that expo, so if we can take that out, that would be great. I'm pretty sure I do not need to use the, um, the rest of these spells, so we're going to save a little bit of spells and probably get the 3 star here. So let's see what happens. Alright, we're at 62% already. Heroes are pretty full health. I've only used my King's ability here. Uh, I'm going to look for buildings to pick off up here while my um, other troops are distracting the defenses. King is taking a lot of the damage here. Oh no, all those barbarians are gone. My Queen is just untouched though. Nothing is touching her, which is always nice. If the Queen's allowed to do whatever she wants, you're, you're going to do good in your attacks. Um, taking out everything. Oh, do they die? Nope, they don't. The king is looking good. All right, this is an easy three star here, guys. Um, but I am pretty excited about December um, being upon us now. As you guys know, I live in Texas, and it is like 20 degrees here. And I don't mean to sound like um, a girl, but I hate the cold. Like, I really, really, really hate the cold. Um, I know a lot of you guys up north are going to be like, oh, that's nothing. It's like minus five up here. But I'm from California. Um, I moved to Texas, and I just I love the warm weather. Um, it, I don't like having to put on a bunch of clothes to just go outside. I like being able to wear shorts and a t-shirt, so cold for me is no fun, unless it's snowing. I mean, I, I don't mind like snow once a year, but when it's just cold out, it's miserable. Um, but anyway, guys, 34 trophies, 987 Dark Elixir. I like that. Um, I think we actually gained some Dark Elixir on that attack, if I'm not mistaken. No, we didn't. We actually lost Dark Elixir. Um, Goewee's really, really expensive with Dark Elixir. Um, but that's okay. I am gonna try to get a defensive replay because I know as soon as we go on, um, as soon as we go off to do our third attack and train these troops, we are gonna get attacked. So hopefully we get a defensive win. We're at 23:28 right now, guys. Our goal is 23:50 for this video, and let's go ahead and get to that third attack. See you guys there. All right, guys. So I just logged back on, and I see that I gained. 48 trophies so in total I gained actually more than 48 trophies I gained 69 trophies total coincidence I think not and if we look at the defenses none of them really matter besides this one right here this guy he was actually trying to beat this defense with uh, this troop composition so let's watch where he attacks from now the worst place to attack this is actually from the top side um, the best place is probably on the left side right now um, but he's gonna go in and those giants are just going to head towards the Tesla. I think he was going for that wizard tower. Or maybe he just wanted all my dark elixir. I'm not really sure if he was going for the win here. Um, but we're going to see what he does. Does he even put down his heroes in this one? I don't think he does. Because he knows he's just going to get wrecked. So this is what this base does. It baits people into attacking. Even when they get near your town hall, the clan castle is going to come out and just devastate everything. And the uh, heroes are going to lure them away. If you guys look... Um, Oops, I'm sorry, I don't want to play that again. Actually, you know what I do? Um, I'm going to go back to my base and I'm going to show you what I mean. Um, so if you look, I got the traps up here, the skeleton traps. And those skeleton traps are going to lure anything that comes in on this side. I need to move one over here. I don't know why I don't have one over here right now. Um, I have to look for that second one. Oh, the second one's right here. I'm actually going to put it over here. 
Um, so anything that does enter over here is going to get lured by three things. It's going, oh, I do have one over there. I didn't even see it. It was right there. Cool. So anything that comes from this side is going to get lured by that skeleton trap, this skeleton trap, or the king or the queen, or the clan castle. So it's just a, a bunch of luring around the town hall, which makes this base awesome. Um, but we are going to go in for a final attack. We already passed our goal of 2350 for this episode because I changed my defense. So hoorah defenses. Um, but yeah, let's head over to our last attack. All right, guys. So we did find our last base here. It is 32 trophies. So I want to go ahead and attack it. Um, this base looks a little bit stronger than the ones we've been attacking, but still not top tier. Um, we're going to go ahead and go in. Looks like he doesn't have any clan castle troops. We were able to lure out a skeleton trap, though, which is nice. Um, if he did have clan castle troops, this would actually be a pretty strong base. I am going to go ahead and attack from the bottom right, I think. I'm just going to search for any traps he might have. I'm going to put down a wall breaker or two and see if he's loaded. All right, there's another skeleton trap. Cool. So that's going to help me lure out these little uh, skeletons over here. Not too concerned about them. They don't do too much damage, but if I can get them all grouped now, that's going to be a lot better for me. So I'm going to put down my golems here. Spread out my witches, always. And the reason you do that, guys, is because the skeletons will tank for the um, wizards. Your wizards are your pretty much your highest damage dealing targets. Oh my goodness, I forgot my heroes. Oh, it's okay. We're still going in. I think we can get a two-star even without that. I am going to need to use my free spells if I want that to happen, though. So I'm actually going to put one down now. Ah, we're gonna go for the two star. I forgot my heroes. That's a new mistake. <laughs> I thought they were ready. My my app said my troops were ready, um, but I guess they my heroes weren't ready. So I just went in for the attack anyway. We're at one star. Or no, we're not even at one star yet. Oh goodness! I saved some archers. We could save this. This could be a fail. Dude, all my troops are like dead. Where'd they go? What was killing them? I had that inferno tower frozen. Oh my goodness! This is gonna be the fail. We're going to have the fail number one of the episode here. Um, unless I can pick off a building. Let's see. Can I pick that one off? All right. I can pick that one off. Can I pick this one off? Nope. Hmm. I can pick this one off. 44%. What else can I pick off? I'm waiting too long, to be honest. Can I pick the... I, I might be able to pick this one off. Uh, no, that archer tower it went a weird way. So I am going to get the two buildings right there. 45%. That's going to die. Anything else going to die? I do have that golem still alive. I'm not sure if he's going to be able to go in. I have a lightning spell, but we're, we're actually going to lose some trophies. We still passed our goal. Oh, I feel so bad. I, I forgot my heroes. We still passed our goal of 2350, but fail attack, man. That's awful. All right. Heroes, heroes are really, really strong in GoWeeWee. That's like the main component of it. I'm hoping this um, golem can actually get through, and he might be able to kill that air defense in time. So I'm actually going to let this one play out. And if that archer can kill that... I don't know if that's going to be enough, but I do have a lightning spell for one of the hero stands over here. Um, I'm not sure if anything else is weak over here either. And if he blows up, that's actually going to be a good thing because it'll do damage to other things. He might be able to take out that and the cannon. We might get one star here, guys. We might get one star. Might get lucky. All right, we're at 46%. We are... Yeah, we're going to get one star. Yes. All right, that's going to die. Whew. Close one. Come on. Come on. Oh, what? I just dropped my lightning spell. I didn't even click on anything and I dropped my lightning spell. That's awful. Oh, that's a fail. I went to move my screen and that happened. I could have gotten 50%. I'm done. All right, guys. That was this episode. I'm not even... That's the biggest fail I think I've ever done. Mine is 18. I used the lightning spell while trying to scroll on my screen. That is awesome. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So... We did end up 115 trophies higher than we started this episode just because of the defenses. Um, my attacks, we won those two right there, and then we lost that one, so that sucks. Um, hopefully that doesn't happen again. So I'm going to keep count of how many I lose. If you guys haven't already, make sure you vote for what troop composition you want to see in the next Road to Champs. That was an awful attack, guys. Biggest fail. I'm going to send that to Molt, actually. That's going to be pretty funny for his... Uh, episode but anyway guys thank you so much for watching let's see if we get 500 likes and you guys like comment subscribe and take it easy